Jumbo. Wrexham versus Oldham FA Cup first round. I'm predicting a one all. It is what it is, but enjoy the vlog. We're getting bevy.
to three. All the way it down the FA Cup first round, come on. Former Wrexham player James Jennings. James, what was your thoughts on today's game, mate? What's my what? Thoughts on today's game? Yeah, easy, easy win for Wrexham. Uh, started off the game well, controlled it, dominated it. Um, I don't think Oldham could. Can, I, don't, I don't think they could uh, deal with Wrexham's intensity. Uh, I was quite surprised actually last season from coming up against uh, Wrexham. A little bit more direct. Um, this season seems to be a lot more playing the ball on the floor and moving it around and switching play. Um, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Generally impressed with the game today. So how different is it from compared to today's performance from when you were in Wrexham? How different is the Wrexham side up in general? Yeah, I think uh, you know you've, you've got a lot more players who are uh, established. You know, league football, um, bigger names. Um, but, you know, equally, you still got to get the results, you know. Um, you've got money in your team, it's always going to be a lot easier. Um, we always had a, a solid back line, but I think from my time at Wrexham, it was always having a striker who scored, you know, 20 plus goals a season. I think that's what um, we probably fell short on. Whereas uh, you look at the forwards at Wrexham now, the likes of Oli Palmer, and that's no disrespect to any forwards we had in my time. It's just that we got a lot better like caliber of players. So I think naturally, when you see the likes of Mullin and Palmer, albeit Palmer was on the bench today, but even Sam Dolby had played with him at some point. Massively, you're always going to get goals, so you know, goals win matches 100%. So, who do you want to see Wrexham face in the next round of the FA Cup? Not Southport County. Um, I think being a Wrexham fan, which you know, I, you know, the club still I've got a great affiliation with the club, club close to my heart. Thinking like a fan or even as a player as well, you want to have an easy second round and then ultimately you want to try and get one of the big boys third round. You want to try and get one of one of the Prem boys, you know, like, like to Liverpool, Man City, Man United away as well. It'd be great at the race course, but you know, away fans go to like the Old Trafford, City, Anfield Road. That's what you want. 100% mate, well thank you so much for coming on the channel, hope you enjoyed the game mate. I welcome mate. From here with hello, and a little mate here, what's your thoughts on the game? Uh, good football, uh, tidy, I hold them, didn't create anything as far as I'm concerned. Um, 
and our whole form is is impressive. We just need to transfer that to away games. That's it. Do you agree, Alan? I agree. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. So Paul Mullen Brace today gets a comfortable three 0 win for Wrexham. Where, where does that take? Where does that take Wrexham? Like, who would you want in the next round? Newcastle away. Newcastle aren't even in the next round, mate. I don't know. Leeds. Eh? Leeds aren't even in the next round. Leeds aren't even in the. Shit. Uh, anyone? Am I allowed to swear on YouTube? Shoot. Oh. No, I want to travel, mate. Oh, yeah. I can rethink it then, Shrewsbury then. <laughs> so what are we, fuck the Tories or not? Fuck the Tories! Fuck the Tories! Fuck the Tories! And last thing, anything else that you want to mention? Feel free. No, it's all good. We're going to get promoted this year. Fuck that County.